Hey everyone, this is Tony Teaches Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to FTP a file from your Mac computer to a remote FTP server without using the FTP command. We're actually gonna be using the curl command that is available on your Mac within Terminal. So let's get on into this tutorial so you can see how to do this. Okay, so just to set the stage here, I have these two files that I want to FTP up to my FTP server here into this specific directory. Um, so how are we gonna do that? Well, by default, FTP is not available on your Mac. Um, I did install it through, through Brew, but if you would normally type in FTP, this would not work. You would get an error message saying that the program wasn't found. Um, but like I said at the beginning of this video, we can use curl to FTP, so let's go ahead and do that. Let me first go into this directory, so it's in my desktop, in the WordPress directory, and in a, another directory called Serial Guru. And then you'll see those same two files we have here, the zip file and the PHP file here and here. Basically, we wanna take them over here. Okay, so how do we do this? Well, the basic syntax, let me just use my cheat sheet over here, make this a little bit bigger, is something like this. curl-t, the name of the file that you want to transfer, and then the URL that you want to transfer it to, a port, and then a username and a password. Okay, so let's give that a go. We're gonna start fresh, and we're gonna type this out together. So curl-t, the file that you want to transfer, let's do the small one first. The installer.php file, and then the domain or the IP address that you want to transfer it to with the prefix ftp colon slash slash, now for me, uh, I'm gonna be transferring it to this URL, which is s22.wpxhosting.com. And now you can optionally put a port here. I'm just gonna use the default port, FTP port 21, if you don't specify a port. And then dash dash user, and then the username for me, it's a bit of a, a mouthy username. It's tony.ftp at serial.guru. And then the password, I'm also gonna copy my password. So I'm gonna type it in. Col so it's the username colon the password, paste. It's okay that we're wrapping to the next line. Oh no, that's not okay. Oh boy, did I, there we go. <laughs> Here we go, no worries. Okay, full command. We got everything that we need. Let's go ahead and execute it. Hit enter and it's doing something. There we go, it's finished. If we go to our um, the, the user interface on the, the client side, or I guess the server side, this would be, we refresh this, we should see that file, the installer.php file in our public HTML directory. And oops, I'm in the wrong directory. So if we go to domains, serial guru, public HTML, there's our installer.php file. Very cool, right? Let's do the other file just to solidify this example. So curl-t, the big zip file, that's a big name. And then basically everything else is gonna stay the same. So the website, dash dash user, username, colon, password, copy that, go ahead and paste it. This one will take a little bit longer because it's a much bigger file, but you can see the progress. It'll take about a minute, two minutes maybe a little bit more, um, but I won't make you sit through that. I think we'll wrap up the video there. Guys, if you have any questions about using curl to FTP any type of file on a Mac to a remote FTP server, let me know in the comments below. I'll do my best to help you out. And if you wanna see more videos like this with um, Mac specific command line tricks or hacks or anything along those lines, I, this is mainly a web hosting channel, but um, a lot of the times you have to send files up to the web host to work with them, to deploy them, and to make them public for all your users. So that's why I decided to put this tutorial on this channel. Um, so yeah, anyway, all that being said, um, please subscribe if you wanna see more, more videos like this. And if you do, I'll see you in the next video.